God, what is going on? Oh my god, there's loads of people. I'm out. I'm out. I'm dipping. Yeah, I'm sure it is. I'm sure it is. Oh god, here comes the first happy customer. Are you going to put loads of stuff on my board again? Oh, why? I don't want to read the newspapers. I'm not interested. Oh, I got a letter. Oh, it's a lovely... Um, it's a lovely bit of hate mail. Love it. Okay, let's grab your information. Thank you very much. And let's see if this is actually working today. Oh, I, s oh, I know why it wasn't working. Last episode. It was because we were tired. That's why. For anything that's not supposed to be on here. We'll get through these cars and then we're going to have to do a prisoner transport. Well, you're not coming in anyway because your information doesn't check out, so... That's too bad for you. Yeah, passport number doesn't match. Yeah. Next one. Let's keep it moving. Justified refusal. Yay! We actually did one right. Oh, I love his tracksuit. Very early 90s. I love it. Can I just say, sir, your tracksuit, your 90s looking shell suit looks awesome. Everything is matching out so far. And he's 31, apparently. So that all checks out. Make sure he's not trying to smuggle anything in he's not supposed to. Good. And that's looking good. Well, I can't see no reason to deny him, so he can go back in. But I can't see no reason. He's passed everything. There's nothing on here. It's, everything checks out. Entry regulations. Let's go for it. He's got no cargo. So... I'm sure we sh have done the right thing. Yes. Okay. Okay, I'm learning. I'm learning. I'm learning. I'm learning what I'm doing. Very fancy car. We've got some posh people in here. Oh, hello, Mr. Posh. Yeah, nice and slow. Nice and slow. He has got some luggage on him. Oh, well, we can't come in anyway because he's got... Um, entry regulations. We're not even going to mess about with it. We're under attack. Well, I'm getting a better position this time. I'm going in. Oh my god, there's fucking loads of them. And I'm shooting him clean in the face, but it's not registering. I'm actually hitting anyone. Oh my god, he's shooting me now. Oh my god, I'm stuck. I can't even move. Oh, here's another one. They just keep coming. Like the cops in GTA just keep spawning. Are we all good? Are we all good? We're all good. Oh my. And that's it, is it? We just just carry on as nothing happened. Right, step on out, please. Let's go for this. Let's get your information. Not valid, not valid, not valid. Expiration date. Wand him. Not that I can arrest him because I've got no room in the cells, so... Yeah, next one in. Come on, come on, come on. I'm going to have to check all of this by my own freaking sights. I don't like it. Don't like it.
Mark at least one actual error. Oh my god. This is getting ridiculous. His expiration date was out. I probably missed it. It's probably a different year or something. I don't know. Oh, he's got another luggage packet in there. Can you believe it? No, you tried to hide that, didn't you? Yes, you did. You tried to hide that. I can't even remember now. No, he, he was correct. He is correct. Right. Chuck all that back in, bud. And let's let him on in. Probably did that wrong. Doing everything wrong today. Yes! We actually did something. Right, I need to take these prisoners. <laughs> for goodness, I need to take the prisoners out. Because we have got no room for these guys. And our warehouse is completely jammed as well. Yep, hope you've enjoyed your time here, but you're all off. All of yours. All of yours. And we want to take all of this as well, don't we? I've got to get all the way to the labour camp, then to the police headquarters. How are you doing? Right, all that over. Not that. Not that. And not that. Okay. Right, let's get up to the labour camp and get rid of these guys. And then we can get back and uh, see what's going to happen from there. Okay, we had to scoot it on a little bit because we actually got ambushed. And, um... People tried to kill us, so, uh... <laughs> so I had to escape once again, people. Um, but we made it here. They shot out my window. I tell you what, this place is just getting dangerous. Absolutely dangerous. Yeah, take them all. Thank you very much. Now I can understand exactly why we need to upgrade. They knocked my and they've knocked the door off. Perfect. So let's get out of here. All the way around. And back out. Right, let's get back up to the headquarters and um, get rid of this contraband. And then we're going to have to look at upgrading our defense. Because if we're going to get attacked, we're going to need a lot more than just our stupid pistol. Right, we're at the police headquarters. Let's get in here. We're going to use... We're basically going to run sirens everywhere we go now because... There's literally people waiting to ambush us out on the roads. It's become a very dangerous place. We're definitely going to need some of those upgrades. That's for sure. Right, you've got loads of stuff here. If you could take all of that, mate. Perfect. Yeah. Right, let's make the dangerous journey all the way back. Oh, I can't believe we've completely smashed everything up in our van. But we are going to head on back. We're going to switch that siren back on. Because we ain't stopping for no one. That is the new rules that I've decided. We don't stop for nothing. Right, finally back at base. I'm going to have a look at those upgrades. Okay, so let's have a look what we've got here. We should probably upgrade him. And he's got a submachine gun. Oh, yes. He's getting upgraded. 350. Yeah. And not him. He needs to get upgraded. There we go. We've upgraded everybody now, and they've got sub-machine guns. So, uh, that should definitely help us out next time they try to attack. I'm going to have my piddly little pistol. But, um, 
at least they've got some proper weaponry now. So I'm going to head off to bed and we're going to start the day again tomorrow and uh, see what other shenanigans we can get into. Till next time, guys, take care of yourselves and I will see you in the morning.